Grandfather says there was a river here once. Then again, Grandfather says a lot of crazy things. He says when the whites first came here, they, uh, our people thought they were like lost brothers told him in old stories and dreams. Our ancestors rushed out the Greek wagons, arms open wide like birds. The whites shot them. Gun, uh, Grandfather says we didn't know what gun, guns were back then, but I don't believe it. Arms open wide? For what? What are they going to do, hug them? Grandfather has this weird story. He says that uh, the water isn't here anymore in this river because the whites drink it all. Why would there be a river in the middle of this desert? I tell him how the whites just sit there in their lawn chairs and watch the water while they're drinking. It's a little crazy when he calls me. The whites are too busy making bombs to watch the water. But I tell him, look, come to my work. I will show you what they do. You lie, he tells me. So, I would just love to jump in the pool and feel the coolness around me and drink so much water I would never go thirsty again. <coughs> but the whites won't let me. No Indians allowed, they say. So I just stay here, I fold up towels, pick up any coins if they drop any, watch the pink clouds go across the sky coming from their bombs. My grandfather still doesn't blame me about the water. 